Surprise after surprise. Love is in the air. But is it for Sharon and Jack or another couple? Watch to find out. One month later. Oh my god! What a mess! I need to get this house cleaned up. <gasps> what is this? A letter? From Sharon. What is going on? Dear Anne, I am writing this letter to tell you that I have moved to another city. There is an open position at another location of the gallery I am working for, and I have agreed to move there. I am really sorry that I have not told you this beforehand. Please forgive me. I realized that things between Jack and me were just temporary. I still miss Peter and the memories I have with him very much. I need time and space to think. Again, I am really sorry for the sudden news. Yours truly, Sharon. Hmm. I wonder what happened between her and Jack. Show me where the money is or I'll kill you. Okay, okay. Y you can take whatever you want. I won't tell anyone. Please spare me. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Jack, what are you doing? Do you have a death wish? Get your hands off me. Whoa, chill out. I am just joking. What's wrong with you? You don't seem too happy. Yes, I'm really not happy right now. Do not mess with me. By the way, what happened between you and Sharon? Nothing. Nothing? Are you sure? I think you are hiding something. Can we please not talk about her right now? I'm not really in the mood for it. Hmm. Okay. So what is up with the house, Jack? What about it? I think it is perfectly fine the way it is. Fine? How is this fine? I can hardly find a place to stand. Your clothes are everywhere. And it smells so bad. What is that smell? Did you not bring out the trash? Okay, okay. I was a bit lazy when you were gone, okay? We can clean it together now, right? Don't be so mad. Whatever, Jack. Alright. Let's start cleaning the living room first. Then we can move on to the kitchen. How about you clean up this mess yourself? It is your fault, after all. Oh, come on. I know you adore me. Please give me a hand. Pretty please. Ugh, fine. One last time. You got it? Yes, ma'am. You are the best. Jack! Alice is calling. Hello, Anne. Do you miss me? Alice, you little rascal, when are you coming back? <laughs> Why, you miss me, right? I know it. Anyway, I'm coming back tonight, actually, and I have a big surprise for everyone. What surprise, Alice? Why didn't you say anything about it? I haven't prepared anything. No need to prepare anything. You will see. Just wait. Don't be so impatient. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? You are being overdramatic, Anne. You will love this surprise. See you later. See you, Alice. All right, all that cleaning for what? Nothing. Why so? Alice is coming back. She is going to trash the house anyway. <laughs> she is not that bad. Well, you are right. Anyway, she also said she was bringing home a surprise. What surprise? Who knows? Would it be a surprise if I already knew? Okay, we can wait for it then. Hi, everyone! Alice! 
so this is the surprise you told me about? Who is he? Yes, isn't he great? Come, I will introduce him to you. Edward, say hello to Anne. Anne, this is Edward. He is going to stay here with us from now on. What? I mean, nice to meet you. How do you know our lovely Alice? Nice to meet you too. I met her in Italy, and we have been friends ever since. She also told me a lot about you. <laughs> really? That's nice of you, Alice. So, where are you from, Edward? I am from Canada. Cool. What about your job? Oh, I am a director, just like Alice's dad. I see. Well, make yourself at home, Edward. Do you mind if I have a word with Alice privately? No problem. Alice, you didn't tell me that he was going to move in here. Oh, I knew you wouldn't have any problems with it. Besides, he is such a great person. You will love him when you get to know him better. But still... Still what? I know you wouldn't refuse anyway. We have enough space in the house, don't we? We do, but you still should have asked Jack and me before bringing someone new home, Alice. Okay, I know. I'm sorry, all right? I will remember to do that next time. There is going to be a next time? You never know! <gasps> what are you doing, Edward? Are you filming me? Yes, now smile. Smile for the camera, Anne. Would you please stop that? I do not agree to this. You are invading my personal space. You are doing so great, Anne. You can actually be an actress with that expression. Just stop! Alice! Alice! Where are you? Come over here now! What's up, sis? Why so noisy? Can you please tell your friend to stop filming me? I am getting really annoyed. Oh, come on. He just loves his job so much. Don't you, Edward? Besides, you look great, Anne. Alice, I need you to tell him to stop! All right, Mr. Director, you can stop working now and take a break. You don't want to mess with Anne. Okay. Uh, Alice, come see this. This is really great, Anne. What if this footage gets aired on television and you become famous? Don't you forget me then. I can be your personal assistant if you want. Looking like that? I don't think so, Alice. Edward, please don't do something like that again. I will not condone to that behavior in this household. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment on my video. Please, subscribe to Learn English with Jessica channel to watch more helpful videos. Goodbye.